today we're going for a little night ride. I got an overabundance of lights on the handlebars of this mean machine. And we're gonna take to Forest Park, which is right over yonder, and uh, see what we can get into. Hopefully this isn't a total wash. Here we go. <laughs> a morning person than an afternoon ride kind of person. I just like starting the day with a bike ride, you know? You get that after ride high all day. The greatest thing ever. But today I wanted to ride in the dark, so. <laughs> Why did you want to do that? Well, I thought it would be kind of fun because it's kind of different. And there's some trails in the park you can only ride when it's dark. You've said too much already. I try a different way into the park a 21% grade into the park. Holy crap. It seemed like a good idea when I was at home, but now I don't know if it feels like such a good idea. Painful, but effective. Oh, it is going to be a sloppy one. Oh my. Oh boy, it's messy. It's already. I'm like a mile into this. I'm gonna be so dirty. <laughs> oh boy. Five o'clock. The sun has officially set. Now we just wait it out and let the games begin. Okay, standing by. Hold on, wait for it. Are we still standing? Wait for it. Oh, yeah, okay. Oh, it's getting dark now. Almost. Almost there. <laughs> Just uh, keeping it low profile for a minute. <laughs> the pro move I learned from the player, Josh Becker, is to put one strong light on the bike and another one on your helmet so that you can see when you look around. Oh, it's such a trip, it totally feels like tunnel vision. I think that was pretty much an experiment. I just wanted to see what that would be like, if it could work, and how I would look afterwards. So much slop, you don't know what to shake a stick at. What? And the ride by the numbers? One hour, 40 minutes, 16 miles, and 1,400 feet of elevation, and like four pounds of mud. Well, it's probably only like a couple ounces, but dramatic effect. If there's anything you liked here, go ahead and hit the like button. If you haven't subscribed, now might be the time. And don't forget to check out the EBD Gear Shop, the greatest place on the internet. Until next time, dear friend, thanks for hanging out. Always a pleasure. This is Dustin Klein, signing off. More like this is Dustin Klein cleaning his bike. Oh, man.